What is up there guys? This is Cobra. Welcome back to another episode of Third Age Total War. Playing as Kand. Things are going good. We just took Harad's capital. Feeling pretty pleased about that. What can I recruit from here? Nothing worth a damn. We got so much gold man for conquering Harad actually that I really feel like we should uh, splash out just a little. Get some good like elite units in. Maybe some good infantry here, some Candish Hunters. They can use flaming missiles. I thought they used spears. How can they use flaming missiles? Fuck it, let's try them. Let's do it, man. Should build like a ballista, catapult. Nah. I wanna see if I can just build any more elites, you know what I'm saying? I don't even know where I'm building these guys at. Where is this? Okay, right here. Build some more good infantry from here. Well, good infantry, you know, you know what I mean. It's not amazing, but... Um... Catapult maker. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna save my gold for now. We gotta clear up this fucking Corsair army down here. And then, we can see about building a Mumakil recruitment network right here. Which makes no sense to me. Does that mean that if you're like, playing as the elves or some shit, and you go on down south and you conquer Ankaragmir, and get its population big enough and, you know, you hold it for long enough, that you can just begin building Mumakil as like, the elves or the dwarves or whatever? Because that... is incredible, isn't it? Oh really, they're taking the fight to me. Alright man, Warlord Arash. What's this gonna be, 400 versus 2000? Ah, uh, their army isn't as big as I thought it would be. Yeah, we've pulled off much, much worse odds than this. Warlord Arash has seen many battles in his time. Look at his command, by the way. It started off like three points. This man has leadership qualities to enable men to go beyond their own abilities on any battlefield. Yeah, man. The four horsemen, dude. Let's fucking have it. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Alright. You know what I'm looking forward to? I'm looking forward to the day that we just have the Warlord Arash. The four other generals. And just like a full army of Brotherhood of the Lance and Brotherhood of the Bow. Maybe with some Mumakil in there. Oh my god, if we have like a Mumakil army. And we can just put all of our riders in like spread formation, you know, like this. Like, uh, where's Arash? This is him. Like, split out formation like this. They're like riding in between the boots of the Mumakil. The hooves, rather. Elephants don't wear boots. And then they're like rushing in, and they're, all the archers on top of the Mumakil are pew 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 pewing over, and they're just like. Bruh, bruh. And it's gonna be fucking so sick. Alright. So. We get a small high ground advantage, which is nice. That's great. Alright, as always, a rash over here with the lances. Always give a rash the lances. These guys are good on the charge and on the flank, so. Let's do that. Uh, all of our archers. You know, I could save a lot of time by just organizing these guys outside of a battle. So that they were already sort of in order, if you know what I'm saying, when it comes time to put them all together. Uh, Brotherhood of the Lance. We got some fresh uh, melee units here as well, actually, which is nice. Is that all of them? Oh, we got some lances here. These guys take our main cavalry unit. Actually, you should spread these guys out for maximum effect. Get these guys in this little pocket. Alright, man, I'm liking that. That's good. Yiltig. The leader of the of the horse archers. I like Yiltig, man. Just because he looks fucking badass, man. Look at him. That's Yiltig's little icon right there. He just looks crazy, man. He looks pissed, you know? Yeah, man. It's gonna be sick. Okay. I think I'll be about ready. All right. You guys form up over there. You guys form up just around here, maybe. And the Arash boys just begin the flanking preparations. Okay, they got pikemen, they got pikemen, they got pikemen. Got some archers. Okay, I'm gonna send Arash over this side, actually. I changed my mind just now. 
We gotta take those guys out. Most of these guys are actually shooting right now. Which is great. Don't shoot a rash as he walks past though, that would be a fucking disaster. Okay, we just gotta outmaneuver these guys, man. Basic stuff, really. The ratchets are rushing in. I'm just gonna juke them away. Not actually charging them here, of course. I don't wanna run into all these pikes, but. I need to juke their ratchets into running, you know? Don't charge in, don't charge in. You see how they all just scatter away like that? That's what we're looking for, man. That's what we're looking for. And now we circle around behind them. While the rest of our boys just keep on shooting. Unleashing so many fucking arrows, man. We just keep on spinning on around here. There we go. And now where we want to be. Now we in position, man. Hit him from behind, man. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You guys are a little close to the pikes. You guys are a little close to the pikes. Get out there, man, before he stabs you up the ass. Okay, they're all turning around. Man, so many arrows coming in, dude. Half these pikemen are going to be fucking dead, man, by the time, you know. Did all you guys get out? They did. Okay. You guys take out this light infantry over here. I'd rather take out those archers. We're gonna mop up these Corsairs here. All good shit. Our heavy cavalry unit is just absolutely decimated the front lines here. Now head on over this way. Victory is well within our grasp. How are we doing over here? Mullying these archers, they're routing. Okay. So many archers, dude, man, just annihilating so many of them. Let's take out these guys now. Here we go. Fucking kill them all. Crushed. Annihilating them, man. Annihilating them. So they got some spearmen on us here. Let's fucking charge these guys. Only half the enemy force remains. We must pray they lose their will to fight. Uh, uh, Brotherhood of the Lance, the shout out of him, man. Yeah, where are you guys at? So one thing, I actually just don't even know where the fucking pikemen are anymore. That's uh, that's one issue that we that we running with right now, that we juggling right now. There's some of the pikemen right there. Okay. Maybe we can just hit them from the the backside with these raiders, you know. Let's try that, man. Yeah, we're gonna fucking annihilate these clowns. Those guys are broken now as well. Okay, man, they're just scattered to the wind right now. They're just scattered to the fucking wind. Oh man, all of our actors now are no longer, uh, no longer have any arrows, so. Where's the Alder Rash? There he is. Here he comes. Let's go. Oh my god, man. The insta route is so real. So fucking real, man. Man, you guys kill those. Man, who's even left alive? We just annihilated them, dude. These Corsairs don't stand a fucking chance, man. Brave men have captured the enemy general. Sweet. He pretends to be a lion, but he seems more an ostrich. Let I was only a captain, though. Watch how true lions fight. It's only random little pleb, you know. There they are. These are the guys I was missing. There they are, man. 
I believe these guys are the last people who aren't technically routing yet, so... There we go. Fucking kill them all, man. Man, I'm kind of worried though, like we're really low on lances here. There's only 13 left in this unit. There's only four marauders left in this unit. Like, this is a separate unit. There's only four left in this one, you know? We're running kind of low on our, on our unit regiments. We're going to have to send people back to get retrained and stuff soon. Alright, man. Look at that! God! 1,100 kills, 40 deaths, man. That's a pretty good ratio, man. That's like my duel ratio in Wrath of Lich King. No shit, actually, man. Back in fucking Wrath, when I used to, like, spam WoW all day, I shouldn't talk about WoW on this channel, man. If I was so much as, like, breathe the word WoW, everyone loses the fucking shit, you know, but... Kill them all. But... There it is, man. The armies of the Haradrim. Uh, though fierce and merciless, couldn't resist the power of the invaders. Every single Haradrim warrior was slain that defended the city, and the citizens are now at the mercy of the invaders. That's us. With this terrible defeat, the legions, legions of the Southrons are fearing that more Harad may fall to, uh, more of Harad may fall to their enemies. Uh, they must fight to prevent this eventuality. Yeah, man, they're pretty fucked. Okay. Hmm. What do I train here? I don't think I train anything though. Oh my god, man, we have so much gold, dude. We have so much cash coming in. I can actually train more Brotherhood of the Lance right here. I'm just gonna fucking do it, man. Order. It's coming together, dude. We must. And I can build the Moomerkill recruitment network. That has got to happen too, man. Yes, That's something I'm afraid I just I'm just powerless to resist that shit. Okay. So where can I train? Where's like my first big? fort that can train a lot of things. Right here. So I'm actually gonna send back a lot of this army. Um, because a lot of these guys need touching up and retraining. I might even just send all of them. No, we'll keep uh, Arash. We'll keep... Uh, these guys are still fine. These guys are still fine. These guys are... Uh, this brother, brotherhood of the oh, these archers, Order. this brotherhood of the bow. How may I serve? These guys are all fine. Um, and continue on, you know, doing what they do. Breaking up into two forces. Order. This army, on the other hand, we need to get them back, man. We move. The sun sets on today's journey. So I should not actually train brotherhood How of the lance there yet, right? Ah, I guess it's fine. Order. Yeah, I guess it's fine. So these guys need to go here, and the rest of these guys. Wait a minute, where else can what else can this train? Lancers, raiders, marauders. Okay, so it can train a bit of everything. So I'll send one lancer. Marauder, marauder. Archer, archer. Here. And then the rest of you guys. Can go towards here. You guys can go and join Arash's Legion. Alright. Nice one, we built a catapult here as well. That's fucking sick. Okay. Gonna get all these guys moved out over here now. With this lovely little catapult. That army might be actually a bit of an issue. Maybe I should just steer towards the river. Or in the fort for now. Those guys are worthless, they're not gonna do anything. Okay, what can I build and where can I build it? Uh, Shrine of Melkor, Nomadic Confederation Camp. Um, let's build the Shrine of Melkor though. I can actually start building in places, man. Oh my god, feels good. Feels real good. Shrines of Melkor popping up everywhere. Trading post, maybe that's good. Is a trading post good to go here? Let's do it, man. Let's do it. I mean, we're earning a lot of gold every turn now, so... Just build a little bit everywhere. Can't quite afford to build anything here, though. I don't really want to build that. 
All right, you know what? This is fine. This is fine. How may I serve? Let's go ahead, save, and end this turn. Man, this campaign is going really fucking good, man. I'm liking it. Of course, once we've eventually mopped up uh, the rest of Harad and fucking took it to uh, Umbap, so we just control all of the south. We are just the fucking south at that point, you know? Then we're up against Gondor. And things may get a little tough then. And Edward expands. Yes, my master. What is it you wish to discuss? Yeah, we already have trade rights with these guys, right? Until we meet again. Ah, uh, who did I miss them with trade rights and stuff? I definitely wouldn't have missed Gondor. Maybe I missed the ends or something. I'm sure I missed something is all. Kandish hunters. Man, what the fuck do you guys think you're gonna do, man? Like, honestly. I might just annihilate those guys, man. <laughs> okay, you guys all have your matching orders, right? Oh, they fucking ignored my shipment from last turn. Okay, fine. I'll just do it manually. It's fine. It's fine. You guys get the. And we just need to retrain everything. Um. Okay, it's fine. I'm willing to wait for that. I'm willing to wait for them to come into stock again. How may I serve? The rest of you guys go up there to be retrained. We rest here until oh man, Arash's army is finally going to be like fully fleshed out again. You know, that's going to be so fucking sweet. Do they have any more Umba armies coming out over here? Don't really see any. I will not waste words on this Harad army looks like it just doesn't know what it wants to do with its life anymore, you know? They're looking pretty upset. Uh, yeah, you guys just stand there. Okay, can I retrain anybody here yet? Uh, units are slowly becoming available for retraining again. Slowly, slowly. What should I build here, man? Should I do this actually so I can reduce all the... Yeah, you know, I'm going to build the Dark Temple of Melkor. I've never built this before, actually, ever. Extra free upkeep unit, re uh, retraining cost reduced by 40%. That seems amazing to me, actually. Let's do that. I won't retrain anything yet. It's ending 3,000 gold per turn, man. It's fucking madness. Okay. Let's take out these guys. Oh my god. You know what? I'm actually gonna fight it. But the only reason that I'm fighting it is because... Um, we have two units of Brotherhood of the Bow in this army now. That's so many elite archers, dude. Like, we have so many elite archers here, man. We got these two units and the three general units. All fucking elite archers, man. That is so fucking sick. You guys at the front. Group up. Get the high ground. It actually increases the arrow range just a little, just a smidgen. And then Arash and his and his marauders. Yeah. Okay, man. Group of you guys. Group of you guys. Where the fuck are they, man? Oh my god, is that it? Is that it? Is that what I just fucking I just opted into this battle, really? What do they got, man? Some pikemen, some archers who are going to get annihilated, and some plebs. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to use it. I'm not even going to risk losing any of these, like, weak marauders. I'm just going to send in Arash's guys to just crush these fucking idiots. Going to run these guys forwards. Run Arash's guys up here. I mean, the only thing they can really kill any of my guys with... Oh my god, when they're all shooting. So many arrows coming out right now, man. So many arrows coming out. Feels bad to be these guys right now, man. Just getting crushed. What the hell is that, man, on the map right there? Random shadow. 
All right. So as long as Arash takes out these guys, we might actually lose zero here. Mold. They're just gone. There's like none of them left. The enemy force remains. We must pray they lose their will to fight. They're just gone. Do we lose anything? We lost zero right there. I believe at least we lost zero. These guys are just getting crushed by my hatches. They're like all fucking dead already. You guys get over here. These guys are coming in. We'll just sandwich these idiots. There's literally just like one guy left. Two guys left here. <laughs> oh man. Why did I even fight this battle, man? Alright. Let's sandwich these clowns, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Better Ash's unit engage first. Gone. <laughs> the enemy general is slain. Our enemy flees before victory is ours. Victory both righteous and well deserved. Okay, I think we lost zero. I think we lost zero. <laughs> Holy shit, man. <laughs> Alright. See, if I auto resolve, I might have lost like 11 riders, man. Fuck that. Fuck that shit. This is have a perfect battle, you know? <laughs> I'm Aragorn, son of Harathorn. They're very creative with names in Middle Earth. I should have released him, shouldn't I? Like the one guy. Oh, man. Okay. Let's end 10, man. <laughs> Let's end 10. Feeling pretty good. Feeling great. Have we actually lost... Oh yeah, we've lost a couple of battles, right? We've lost Ankaragmir twice now. But I don't think we're going to lose it again, man. I think our cavalry is just too fucking strong now. What the fuck are these guys order. doing, man? Noble one. Nice, man. We just trained some fresh Brotherhood of the Lands. That feels pretty good. Get them all the way down to Amrun. Alright. Can I queue up any more retraining yet? Guess not. A lot of these guys are getting retrained already, though, so that's good. Get these guys in here. Retrain everyone. In one fell swoop, actually. Man, I can start making, like, a second cavalry army, even. I Maybe mean, I should just, like, save all my cash for elites and stuff. No, you know what? I'm just gonna invest in, uh... In old buildings and stuff for now. That's what I'm gonna do, man. That's what I'm gonna do. Yes. Okay, should I try and take these guys out? Woodland Realm and Mechwood. Okay, so we built something over here. We built the farms here, right? Yeah. Okay. Caravan stop. The grain exchange. Meeting hall. Meeting hall's good. Meeting hall is always good. We'll just build that for now. And see if we can build any upgrades after that as well, but... Uh, we're all very, very Melkorian already. Oh yeah, I could build something over here, couldn't I, in these places? Just military lodgings, maybe? Um, because we can also build something down here, too. I built some military lodgings up here, man. That's what we'll do. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, my, it's moving out more fucking peasants and shit. This place, we can't retrain for shit just yet, and it doesn't matter because I'm going to wait anyway. Question is, do I take this battle, man? That is the question. We can actually just roll out these guys as well. Get like a good little reinforcement battle going. Something like this. That seems reasonable to me. I should wrap this episode here though, man, before we do this. So let's do that. <laughs>
Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you're all enjoying the campaign so far. I'll catch all you guys in the next one.